sandbags amid flash flooding. Overnight, dozens of severe weather reports, including baseball-sized hail. There is still a line of storms headed across the south with potential for even more tornadoes in the overnight hours. Now, with so many people already indoors following those coronavirus guidelines, officials want to make sure that you have tornado alerts ready to go on your phone because you might not hear those sirens blaring outside. Tom? Victor Okendo in the path of the storm tonight. Victor, you and your team stay safe. Let's get right to ABC senior meteorologist Rob Marciano tracking those storms. Rob? Hey, Tom, this tornado ongoing now. Let's get right to it. We have several watches that are posted, including a PDS watch outlined in red. That is very dangerous. We've already had not one, not two, but three damaging large tornadoes on the ground in Louisiana, Mississippi. Those will progress to the east. We'll have flooding rains to the north, snow on the backside. It is in a tornado threat tomorrow morning from North Florida all the way up through the mid-Atlantic. And then strong winds wrapping around that cyclone for the northeast from Detroit to Boston. Winds 60 to 70 miles an hour. Those temporary tented cities here in New York will be a dangerous spot tomorrow. Tom? All right, Rob, thank you for that. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out.